Howdy, folks. Shabby's back. And he's back to... Walk back and forth between the barn and the farmhouse. All all day. That's the whole stream. Just walking back and forth, and then we're going to stop it. We'll do that. We'll see how many times we can do it in an hour. How about that? <laughs> okay. Now, actually, we have a bear down at the barn. And... Uh, we gotta look for an arrow today, and we gotta get all the a lot of the stuff over to. I could eat anything right now. Uh, over to, um, the f uh, wait a minute. This is okay. Hang on. Sorry. A lot of things are happening at once here. Okay. Let's see, lost my train of thought here. So we gotta, we gotta. Get the bear taken care of, find an arrow, and probably take much stuff over to the farmhouse. And um start to make some headway on the on the bear coat is the plan. Hey love my Kia. Well, how about that? <laughs> Good morning. <laughs> okay. Um Load, here we go. Here we go. I'm just I've only taken one sip of coffee this morning, so I'm still I'm still waking up. I'm still waking up. Um, okay, we got a bear. Let's see what the weather is first before we do anything. It's middle of the day. This is good. Give us some time to hopefully find this arrow if... Um, look at this. This is good crow weather. Well, it's a little breezy, but... I, might be crows out in this. I don't know. 30 minutes till melted. Man, we need to, we really need to get cooking. Two, that's another thing. And is this right? Here we go. Alright, run out of fuel. Oh man, look at this. Alright, let's throw, let's throw coal on. I might run over to, I might run over to, uh, Thompson's Crossing, maybe. Oh yeah, we're gonna just we're just we're gonna use our tablets. That's right. Um, let's get some water. Let's actually let's um let's cook meat. I watched the I rewatched the video and I, I burned six ki kilograms of meat. Putting it into this. Just gone. <laughs> oh well. That's okay. It, we'll be fine. We'll be okay. You're chilling in Mystery Lake. Uh, left by cured maple and coastal. So I grabbed another one and while waiting, Ugh, grabbed two. Tongue feels like sandpaper. Ptarmigans. Six bunnies. Two deer carcasses. You have like a ton of guts, sounds like. That's awesome. That's great. Yeah, that's how you do it, man. That's how you do it. Um, okay. I'm going to purify this water before I forget right now. Oh yeah, we have cabin fever. That's the other thing that's going on. Let's see. I think I have enough to purify all of this. Yeah, we can purify all of this water here. It seemed like the occasion to use this. You're about to head out to Forlong, all right. <laughs> Why do people say Forlong? I mean, I know, I've, I've heard Deadpool say it many a time. I mean, that's the only way that Deadpool says it, which I think is hilarious. Is that where you got it from? Just curious. You heard the twitchy, uh, the, sorry, the heard the Travois glitchy, yes. Tw I said twitchy. <laughs> Uh, yeah, I've heard that too. I've heard that too. So I'm a little nervous, but I guess we'll just we'll just face the challenge when when it occurs. Okay, let's wait till this this meat is done, and then we'll go. Um, probably just go out that way, and and then down to the Thompson's Cross to see if we can find that wayward arrow that's stuck in a. Hopefully. dead wolf right now. 
or hopefully soon to be dead wolf. It wasn't that long ago that I shot it. Uh, okay, I don't know. I'm gonna grab a, I am gonna grab a torch off of this, and we'll see. I think that might get both of them cooked without burning them. I'm hoping. Uh, <laughs> okay. It's a little too breezy out here, folks. Too breezy. Let's get our arrows. We got four in there, so maybe... I thought I shot it six times. And I know I, I broke one arrow on it. I don't know. I'll have to do a, I'll have to do a arrow count at some point. One of these days. Hang on for a sec. Okay, it was a never mind, <laughs> never mind problem. Those are the good. Those are the good kind of problems. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I do like what's yeah. It's funny to look and see what's saved. Like, like what's the frequently written thing or something. On your texts. My daughter was playing a game last night with her friend on her on her phone, and they were just, I think they were just like typing. They were just using whatever the auto, the autocorrect was suggesting, or something like, or like suggested next word. They were just clicking the next word that the phone was suggesting, and it was just hilarious. It was so funny. the 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 sentences it would create by doing that is pretty funny. And then there's emo emojis mixed in there too. It was it was pretty funny. I think if we get up on this road, we might have a better chance of, of spotting that wolf. I didn't even look if I'm like ready for this trip or not. Do I have my bedroll? I do. Okay. Well, that's the main thing. That's the main thing. Okay, I'm hearing crows. There's, of course, there's lots of dead things around here, so who knows, but... Let's see, where are these crows? These flyover crows? Okay, they must have been flyover crows. Lately, I've just been having better luck like, just seeing... Seeing the wolf. Instead of actually hearing the crows. Let's look up this way. Okay, there's a wolf, but it's probably not our wolf, I would guess. Let's look up this way here. And there's so many trees, too. I need to get a bunch of sticks for bed rolls, or uh, well, just for fuel. I need I need fuel anyway, so should be grabbing some sticks as well. Oh wait, a minute. I think I see something way. Hang on, let's just investigate. It's probably just a piece of wood way out there. Where'd you get the Mackinac? Where'd you where'd you find it? I think that was just a piece of wood or something. I'm seeing. Oh man, this is this the the wolves can run super far. They can run so far.
trying to figure out where I'm trying to remember where I got my oh I got my Mackin on the farmhouse that's where I got mine oh hitting some wind here guess we can grab some some more coal at Tom, at Thompson's Crossing we'll just take it take it with us it's a goddamn freezing There's some crows right there. There's two sets of crows. Let's go over here. Either trappers or the cave that's above Mystery Lake's cabin. Yeah. There's the, that's, that, that's the same one that has... Is that the cave with the bedroll? Sometimes? Near the bunker? Okay, there's a deer carcass. And then hopefully there's a wolf carcass right here. Over this hill. Let's go check it out. I'm, I'm feeling pretty optimistic that this is going to be the wolf, but we'll see. I'm going to go over here and grab feathers first, though. Yep, there's a dead wolf right there. All right. Arrow recovered, baby. Now, there is another wolf lurking about, so we got to be a little cautious here. Stick. Sticks and feathers, baby. There's our wolf buddy. I think we can stay out of his his area. Sweet. Easier than us. Uh, easier than what I thought. And the crows helped for once, which usually, but I didn't hear him. I saw him, so I don't know. <laughs> so which way? I think I can just go this way. Yeah, before that, my only upper outer layer was just a pathetic windbreaker. <laughs> uh, from from beachcombing. Nice. The trusty old windbreaker. Okay, let's warm back up. Man, I'm glad I'm, I'm I'm really happy that we got that. I was I was dreading that that search. Cause you just never know how it's gonna go. You never know. I found one my ma I found one uh, I, in Mystery Lake I found a arrow by mapping the Polaroid I wasn't even trying to do this but I mapped the Polaroid and I found a and there was a wolf carcass that showed up on my Polaroid map and I was like oh my god that's where my arrow is and it was way way super far away from where I shot the wolf I couldn't believe how far away it was but sure enough it was there so you just like it's it's crazy how far can they can run <laughs> very very far sometimes okay let's get some water put away here Oop. okay all right i guess we could just go out and get a maglens fire we don't have a lot of fuel maybe i should just focus on trying to get this bear taken care of and then getting getting the bear back to um the farmhouse i think that might be the best thing to do crows secretly watching us and reporting back to the game <laughs> that we need to kill this school <laughs> yeah i wouldn't put it past them absolutely i wonder why it says cold on those because it's not like it matters what the temperature of the meat is it doesn't it doesn't make it doesn't factor in at all. Strange. I don't know. 
found an air on the ceiling of the dam in the dark hallways. Really, you know, you can also find an arrow in the um, the door to the like the door that goes from the lower dam to the upper dam. There's an arrow stuck in in a metal door, which I always thought was like curious. <laughs> like, okay, how did that happen? Okay, we got seventeen six. We gotta save some for a. Um, we're gonna make a snow shelter at the farmhouse. Depending on how this goes, I don't know. We'll see. I'm not sure how this is gonna go. Probably have to warm up some teas and then just start uh, quartering the bear, and then we'll just load it all up on the on the sled and take it. That's, that's what I'm thinking right now. Get a couple little teas here. Yeah, it's dark. It's dark in the dam. I mean, it's really dark in the dam now. It's hard to see anything. All right. Let's get an hour on this. Well, it'll last an hour. Let's get it close to an hour. Okay. All right, let me go out here and try and do this. Make sure there's no wolves around. I don't have my hacksaw yet. Well, it doesn't matter because we're quartering. Okay. Here we go. Oh, we do have a hacksaw. Needs to be repaired for sure. <laughs> we'll use our axe here. Okay. Oh, my goodness. Oh, wow. Holy smokes. Okay. Ooh, we nailed it. 59 minutes. All right. Well done, Shabby. You're a good guesser, Shabby, I guess. That was a total guess how long that was going to take. Oops, did I pass it? Wait a minute. There it is. Okay. Now see, I can pack the, I can pack the meat into the travoy now, without it disappearing because it's cooked in the, in it, you know, it's like the condition is improved. I want to leave some food here though, and just, damn, there's not that much left. That's that's too bad. That was gonna be my food supply while I, um, while I crafted, but um. Oh, you're kidding me. <laughs> Alright, we'll do it this way. Here we go. <gasps> you can't quarter carcass that's more than 75% frozen. Okay, alright. That's a new one for me. Wow, okay. Yeah, the bedroll trick is awesome. That's that's the way to go. I mean, Come on, it can... I mean, I think on my last stream, I was fumbling around the barn, even with the bedroll light, but so it doesn't always work. Perfect. Dang. All right, I think this will be good. So much for my sticks. I think I have a pile of sticks at the. Eh, maybe I don't. Hmm. Starting to feel numb. Oh, it's already on. Okay. Well, that didn't take long. <laughs> okay. Okay. Thirty-eight minutes. Are these cooked? Four minutes. Alright, I want to make sure this cooks. I'll throw one more stick on there. Let's get a little bump here. Finish the quartering. Mm. 
My goodness, hacking away at that thing. Wow. I like how one gut just ended up way over here by itself. All right, we're we gonna get a we're gonna get a an aurora or what? I don't know. You upped your harvesting and fire strength to three, and food is almost four now. All right. This is probably, I'm definitely in one of my slowest, um, slowest rates of getting to cooking five on this run. I am, I'm not really pushing hard on that. Um, but we'll get there. We'll get there eventually. It really does. It, the game becomes so much easier once you hit cooking five. It's crazy. And these are all good. See, this is when I'm, I'm going to start shooting wolves now with this. Uh-oh, hang on. Don't get lost out here. All right. We're completely exhausted, which makes me wonder if this is a good plan or not. Oh, my God. Well, okay. Looks like we're staying here for tonight. We're staying here. <laughs> Okay. Well, that. <laughs> oh no. Bedroll flashlight. Here we go. There's the truck. All right. Well, you know, I did have a half a second in my brain. Like, I wonder if this is going to poison me or not. Um, but let's go ahead and. Look at that, no mushroom teas made. Oh, we got antibiotics, so let's just use those. All right, let me make sure I did it. Okay, we're good. All right, I am gonna drink a birch bark tea. All right, let's get some sleep. Sleep off this food poisoning. Oh. <laughs> oh, no. Cabin fever, I forgot. Okay, it looks like we're making a... It's like we're making a bed roll out here. Man, this is a dangerous situation. This is no joke. This is no joke, y'all. Let me make sure I'm going to... Go the right way here. Wait a minute. Why am I all... Oh, oh, it's because I'm... It's because I'm turned around. That's why. Let's see. This is the... I think this is the front. This is the back of the truck, I think. No, man, I'm totally backwards. I think I'm just backwards here. I'm I'm confused. This is the fire barrel, I think. Here we go. Holy smokes. Yeah, I mean we can maybe I can just sleep in the in the tractor. We got a we got an Aurora. I have four pieces of coal. Oh man. Oh well. Let me just see if I can sleep in the tractor, like, just right now, without a fire. We'll just sleep for, like... Yeah, we can sleep for a bit. Let's just sleep in little bumps here. We won't worry about trying to recover health. We'll worry about surviving the night. <laughs> That's more important. This is cool. I wonder where this light's coming from. Our tractor's all lit up. I wish we could just drive it right now. That'd be great. Fire it up. Let me get all this meat over to the farmhouse. No problem. Okay, we'll sleep another hour. Okay, we're still in the good zone here.
Okay. Still doing all right. Tractor to the rescue. I don't know if I've ever slept in this tractor before. All right. I think it'll be all right. I'll sleep another hour here. Okay, we'll probably, you know, probably getting to the point now where we need to keep an eye on things. Let's see. Um, five more hours. All right. Um, yeah, I don't think sleeping another hour is a good idea. It's just going to keep getting colder. Let's go ahead and just, we'll make a fire out here. Out of the wind. Not stinky, so don't have to worry about that. Got ourselves in a little bit of a pickle here, folks. Come on, little fire. Not bad, but it could have been bad. I mean, cabin fever. I never really thought about the combination of cabin fever and food poisoning, but that could be pretty oh, dangerous yeah. combo. Luckily, we had an outdoor place to sleep right away. I'm just gonna do one coal at a time because. Um, it's very likely to get blown out, so we'll just do one at a time. I don't, and then, you know, if, when the wind shifts, we can make a new fire, use a new piece of coal. And we'll just do it in one, one hour increments here. Should be making water. Wish they would add a snow track puller. Basically a little sled like dogs pull, but a lot, small, a lot smaller you can stand on. Has a set of tracks instead of dogs to pull. Oh. Interesting. I always thought that uh, like snowshoes would be would be cool. You can walk a little bit faster on the snow or something. Um, let's get some water going. We do one and a half in an hour. All right, we've cooked. Okay, there's nothing to do but make water, I guess. So let's just do that. Let's sleep for an hour. I could be. I could be doing stuff, but I need to really. I just need to sleep off this food poison. So really, I think probably my best thing to do is to sleep and try to do something while I sleep I guess let's do one and a half one and then we'll sleep again for another hour they would add snow areas that we couldn't go without because it oh <laughs> you think they would i mean maybe it would be crazy though like you can't get past here unless you have snowshoes otherwise you go into like a snow drift and get stuck in there <laughs> is that what you're thinking How many hours are we at now? Let's see. Two more hours. Okay. We survived another night. I'll throw a few sticks on. Alright. See if we can squeeze out another... Are we out of sticks? Is that it? Yeah, that's it, isn't it? Shoot. I think there's some sticks inside. I 
Lantern's not doing any good right now. There's no, we have no fuel. Let's see here. Grab a few of these. All right, back to our tractor. Our tractor home. Okay. Let's see. We'll throw one more stick on. Okay. Alright, another hour. There we go. Food poisoning. Off moose meat, huh? Okay. Well, it was ruined only a few minutes ago, and then I throw it on the fire. You think it brings it back to life? <laughs> no, not quite, Shabby. Not quite. Alright, excellent. 24 more minutes on there. Um. Got five sticks. Let's go ahead. Yeah, let's just go ahead and just do it. One more hour in here. I think that's all we're. Yep. Okay. There we go. No more food poisoning. Okay, I'm going to run and get some coffee real quick. We'll be right back. Let's enjoy the our view from our tractor. I guess I'm, I'm I guess I'm the breakfast king or something in this house like make me breakfast uh, I just do such a good job at it that's what that's really what it is that's my that was my mistake all right let's pick this stuff up I'm gonna start loading our travoy up probably not gonna get that second oh yeah we missed it that's okay all right, I'm going to put this water in there also. We can leave a I wonder if I can drop any we'll Leave like here. a bottle of water here for future shabby just in case he really needs it. Let's see. I hate when the scroll wheel won't scroll down. All right, let's put put 8 liters in here. Um, what else? Man, this... Gotta make some pancakes, y'all. That's what I should have done. On that fire. But I don't have any flour. Oh, we left our flour. That's okay. That's okay. Let's just put some of our tools in here, I guess. Okay. All right, now we'll just load up some meat on here. Maybe I should just bring the Travoy over. Let's do that. Okay. Let's see, how do we use this thing? Oh my God, this is amazing. Yeah, you can't make a super tight turn, but it's not bad. Now, what do you? How do you drop it? Okay. Oh, you looks like you drop your like a like you disarm yourself or something. It's like all right. Actually, let's just grab it all. Freezing. Oh my gosh, I can't move. 
that's funny. We have a wolf on us here in a second if we're not careful. There is definitely a wolf in the neighborhood. Oh, that's it, huh? Wow, look at that. It's, we're loaded. We loaded the whole thing. Let's see what's our what's our current weight. All right, we're way below here, so we can actually probably take some of the stuff off. Oh wait, this stuff. Here we go. Make some room. The hammer. I think we need about 10 kilos. Oh, we're not quite there. Actually, hang on. Let's just do this. Okay. Now, I think this will fit on. Yes. Okay. All right. All right, let's warm up. Guess we're we'll gonna have to get, just carry this meat. We'll leave some of it here. We're, we're gonna be in a, like a little bit of a food situation. I'm cons I'm a little concerned about that. We have two bear hides secure, and we we'll have to just come back for these guts, Kieran. And we're going to have to focus on recovery, too, once we get back to the... Man, well, there's so much we got to do now. <laughs> we still have to make the bear coat. But we also need to... Um, we, we, can, we can recover our health. That's not a problem while we, while we do that. But I think the issues are uh, cabin fever. And the next one is... Uh, do we still have cabin fever? Yeah, I don't even know. Like, we're one hour away. So we can't even sleep in here right now. Or pastime. Um... I can chop up a box though. Let's just do this. Go upstairs. Um, so what I was saying was, we gotta harvest the bear. We're just gonna run out of food. I think that's part of our issue right now. And what else? What else do we need to concern ourselves with? I don't know. There's just a lot going on. I think the point of... I think what would be helpful if we had some food to eat. Especially food that wasn't going to poison us. Alright, let's take some of this stuff. Let's see where, where are these at. 49. Everything's at 49%. I'm not sure I can carry much All right. Oh, we have a little bit of food. And we do have a sprain risk, which I don't like. Let's see if we can get some of it in here. That looks like that's it. Okay. Still have a sprain risk. Oh, well. All right. Let's get out of here. Going pretty slow. Going pretty slow. I um let's see, did I get a stem here? Um I can't remember. Well, Oops, wait a minute, how do we... Oh, oh, I hit the wrong button. Hit the wrong button. I'm just going to eat my way out of this situation. There we go. Alright. Alright, I got to figure out something here. This is not going to work. I'm going to, I'm going to like... I'm going to freeze to death walking over to the farm. I'm going to the farm. Um, I'm going to make a bear coat over there. All right, it's too, too cold in here. I'm going to make a bear coat is the main thing, but I'm going to, you know, take care of this bear that I just killed. 
and um where are my are my bear hides back at the farm i think they are i think the two cured ones i'll double check before i leave As always, I have too much stuff. All right, let's just sleep for an hour. That cabin fever risk is going to still be on us, so we'll have to we'll have to make a snow shelter by the fire pit at the farmhouse or. something or sleep in the car something like that okay the two bear hides must be we'll come back we're gonna come back okay I'm gonna drink some coffee maybe I should just drink some coffee Look how fast our, our temperature's going down. Yeah, I'm going to sleep for another hour. Sorry, I know this is tedious, but I don't want to I don't want to die. So, <laughs> you just have to bear with me here. I didn't realize it was going to be this. I thought it was going to be a little bit. I mean, I, it is fully loaded. That Travoy is almost 100% full. So it's going to be slow, I guess. Not going to be whisking. Uh-oh. Okay, another, another blizzard. Okay. Now, do I have a book to read? Of course, I probably don't. <laughs> There's probably no book in here. I don't think there is. <laughs> oh, shoot. No book. Let's see, let's get some, uh, I'm trying to think if there's any metal in here. I could break down this for metal and then we could repair our hacksaw. It might be worthwhile. I think I'm just going to break down some more boxes. in those crates okay I used there used to be stuff in those crates I'm almost positive back in the day Pleasant Valley blizzard baby It sounds like it stopped, but I, I don't know. That would be a very quick blizzard if it did. You never know. The wily Pleasant Valley. You never know what it's going to do. Maybe it's just maybe it's just tricking me to to leave the sanct the sanctuary of the barn. And that's gonna kill me out in this field. All right, here we go. This is slow going, man. This is like too far to drag this thing, man. At this speed, this speed is awful. All right, we'll see. <laughs> see what happens. I might have to make a fire out here, man. I'm 
get behind a hay bale and make a fire? No. My fingers feel numb. I noticed that I just now noticed that I really like to look around. But you can't do that whenever you have this uh travoy going. I mean you can, but it's just like you're sort of weaving around around. Probably not a good idea. to stop and then look. Oh, you can't even look that far left or right. Interesting. Okay. You can see the top of the silo. That's where we're headed. But I think what I'm going to do is just make a little fire behind this hay bale. Warm back up. If only had some flour, make some flapjacks out here in the field. <laughs> okay, let's make a fire right here. Oop, hit the wrong button again. There we go. We're figuring it out. There we go. Okay. fire I'm gonna start harvesting some of this bear meat we'll lighten our load a little bit let's see here I probably have to use a piece of coal I'm running out of coal man I'm this is not it's not the best little situation I'm in right now I'm not, I'm not really liking this Okay, let's get out of the out of the wind. Fourteen minutes. Okay, yeah, it's frozen. Did the wind stop right when we make a fire? But <laughs> Pleasant Valley, it's evil. Like, oh, you're gonna be fine. You're nice and warm. Okay, well, never mind. We'll just end this. We'll just end this storm. No problem. Now that you made a fire and. You're going to waste a little bit of time out here. All part of the master plan. Those tracks are awesome. Get a little screenshot of that. Cool. Alright, an hour. I guess let's just go ahead and just crank on it. i got to repair this hacksaw too. So many things to do. So many things. Never a dull moment. 42 minutes. Alright. Okay. We're, we're doing it. Taking care of it. Six more minutes, all right. This is fun. I like this. Got a little hay bale for shelter. <laughs> Good times. Pretty chill out here. Who knew all I have to do to stop a blizzard in, Ple in Pleasant Valley is just make a fire. That's the secret. I figured out, I've unlocked the mystery. Oh. Hmm. 
I mean, just as long as the game thinks that you're wasting your fuel, then it's like, oh, okay. Mission accomplished. Oh, this is beautiful. Love it. Okay. I'm not sure I can carry much more. This hacksaw is working overtime, man. We gotta repair this thing. <laughs> gotta take care of it. Thirty minutes on that. Okay. I like to get it out of in inventory just in case I'm stinking, but I think I have learned that. Well, I have shown that you don't stink while you're harvesting. So while you're in this mode, you're, you're kind of invisible to wolves and bears. Of course, once you come right out of it, if there's a bear or wolf right there, then look out. <laughs> you're in trouble. Alright, let's just keep on cranking. I mean, the weather's nice. Might as well. This has to be done, so. Just keep on cranking away. Fifty-seven minutes, alright. One more to go. Oop. Oop. There we go. All right. Man, this bear kill is going to be tough. It's going to be tough to do this. It's basically two days of being inside. Twenty-one minutes. Okay, let's start loading everything up. Like We're gonna stink to high heaven. <sighs> oh shoot! Nope. Nope. Hit the wrong button again. There we go. I think the bags weigh twice as much as the meat. So yeah, you save a lot of space by doing that. Okay. 12 minutes. I think it's warm enough where I don't really need to worry about getting any teas. Because we spent the whole day out here in the field. Now the question is, are we going to get an Aurora? Because it sure feels like it. Sure feels like it. Okay. Now let's see if we can get unburdened here. We've got to drop about three kilos. This is way faster. Oh, there we go. Sweet. Now I hope I can get up this hill. Oh, this is much better. Just 
so let me see you can use your okay you still have to just you can't do anything until you drop that until you drop it okay I mean I was just thinking maybe I should have gone up on the road it probably would have been safer to take the road actually Shoot. Dang it. Alright, well, let's just see. <laughs> I'm picking a spot where I think I can get over the... You know, over this little creek here. We'll see. This is not gonna be too steep. That's what I'm. I don't know. I'm just inexperienced, so we'll see. I don't know. Okay, this isn't. This is no problem. This is not a problem. Of course, it is the other side I was worried about. It looks like we can make it. Probably can make it up this little rise here. So let's go this way. I need to be ready for anything here. I'm gonna do a little scout. I'm gonna scout real quick. Let's get a little drink. I'm glad there's no Aurora. I'm really glad there's not an Aurora. Okay, there's a wolf right there. There's three wolves. <laughs> oh no. No. Do I if I don't floor him up soon? Alright. Let's just do let's let's be a little Uh we're we're archery four now. Come on. We can do this. Let's just let's just take him out. Let's take him out. I don't like being cold like this. I'm trying to do this. Maybe I should just pop back into the house and warm up. Shoot. And where is he running off to? You? Oh, oh, it broke. It broke. Terrible shot. Terrible shot. Oh, man, let's just warm up. I don't like being this low health, it makes me nervous. Alright, we have no fuel in here, of course. Shoot. Alright, no fuel. No fuel. Oh, it sucks. Well, I have fuel on me. I think. Let me just see. Yeah, I have the reclaimed wood. So let's just... Let's just go in here. We'll make a fire. I just want to keep my fire going. All this to save a match. Come probably on. not worth it. It's pr probably not worth it. <sighs> and of course we left our... Oh no, here we have a pot here. Okay. <laughs> Alright, I just don't want to waste any time here. Okay. Um. <clears throat> I 
Okay. Probably wouldn't be bad to have a warm, a hot tea on us. Two more wolves to deal with here. I had no idea it was going to be this complicated. <laughs> no idea. In my mind, it was going to be just so simple. We really need to shoot this wolf in the face. That's, that's very important. Shoot in the face. Ouch. Dang it. Oh, missed them both times. Oh well. I was trying to shoot earlier. That way the, um, before he, you know, turned, turned, changed direction, but it was, I don't know. It was sloppy. What can I say? It didn't work out. Alright, we'll try it again. We'll, 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 we'll zero in on this. We'll figure it out. There we go. Of course it broke anyways, but I'll take it. I'll take it. Okay, here we go. One more. Oh, there's a fourth one up there. Okay. Oh my god. Terrible shot. I don't know why I moved it. I turned at the last second. There we go. Right in the face. Okay, now cleared it out. Let's get let's get everything back to the house. <laughs> I can't believe this took an hour. Wow. I can't feel my hands. I left a piece of meat somewhere too. Let's see. Dropped it out of my invent. Oh, it's right here. Okay. You know what happens? You just drop your torch. You just snuff it out. I don't know. I bet you snuff it out. Well, I'm glad I did that. I just hope there's not any more. Four seems like that's what, you know, four seems like the max to me around here, but I guess we'll see. Okay, I want to park this on the porch right by the porch and then we'll and then we'll get into the magic bed <laughs> apparently one of the beds in the farmhouse it actually heals you faster than other beds um, I don't know how much testing has gone into this but rumor has it that this bed and then I think there's a gray mother's bed and then I think there's one or two more that will give you a little bonus to healing so hopefully that's true here we'll take advantage of that we'll sleep in our cozy little bed all right there we go special delivery all right let's go in here and see what's going on with our fire Oh, it's gone. Okay. No big deal. Um, I don't know if the meat... I'm just gonna... I'm just gonna offload all the meat just in case it's... You know, stays better. Or keeps or whatever better outside of the Travoy. I just wanna lay down for a bit. Oop. Okay, then we'll get these. Alright. 
Let's go inside. Let's sleep. I'm sure I'll, Cabin Fever, the specter of Cabin Fever will be haunting us once again. Um, I'm gonna use this better old trick to get up the stairs. Back up to our bed. Here's the stairs, going up the stairs. And then I think you have to do sort of like a 180, I think. Here we go. And then go this way. Here's the bed right here. Okay, found it. Who needs a lantern? Um, all right, let's get some food. I'm gonna eat some of this moose meat. Hopefully it won't kill us. <laughs> uh, my goodness. I didn't have mushroom teas, man. That could have been bad news. Luckily I had the antibody. I never really don't care around these very much, but um, I guess we, we, and we, yeah, we don't even have, we have no mushroom teas. That was not the best of moves. Okay, folks, we're going to stop here. I think, I think um, Shabby's going to call it. Some herbal tea would have been nice, but that's okay. Okay, so next time, next time we're going to, um, all right, we've got a respectable amount back here. That's good. Let's see what kind of day we're looking at here. I'm going to finish this little piece of meat we got. Okay, all right, looking good, looking good. Um... All right, so what are we looking at? We're looking at making a bear coat when we get back, or, or next time. Um, and that is, I think it's 60 hours. <laughs> 60 hours. Oh, my goodness. Um, the guts are in the, let's see, how many, you need six guts, is that what I said? I think we have a pile of guts in the Travoy. Bear coat. It needs you need four guts. Okay. Let's just look in here real quick. Yeah, we got eight. Let's just unload it. I wonder if I can drop any of this gear. Alright. So sixty hours to make the bear coat. So we'll be we'll be busy. We'll be busy beavers on the next one. Let's get ready. All right, we boiled all this. Great. Excellent. Okay. All right, yep. So we'll be making the bear coat um and maybe because I don't, I think I only have, I don't think I have, really have any moose meat on me. Maybe a little bit. Oh, here's some, here's four pieces. That'll last us a bit, but we might need to hunt a deer, possibly. We do have the porridge, things like that. So maybe we'll be okay. Maybe we won't have to hunt. Um, and I think that might be the entire stream, just making the bear coat. And dealing with that probably have to deal with cabin fever we're gonna make a we'll make a snow shelter out there by the fire pit and yeah i think that's it and then we'll just try to recover health and get set up for future adventures i just don't know what that's going to be yet probably we'll do signal void will be the next thing i might go into the dam might just pop into the dam so we can get another pot because having one pot here sucks. Um, so that's something else we might do before we go off on Signal Void adventures. The real question is, would you take a Power Wheels car, cars down a mile hill? <laughs> yeah, I think I would. That sounds fun. That sounds fun, absolutely. Um, okay. All right, I think we, just, just to make sure we saved everything, let's just, pop in and out real quick and 
once again, lovely hanging out with you. Love my Kia. Mr. Barley, sorry, I'm just now calling it a day if you just now popped on. Any lurkers out there? Everybody. Um, next time. Yeah, sorry, Mr. Barley. <laughs> it was, uh, it was just a, it was me trying to get the Travoy and all the bear meat back over here. So that, that's what you missed. Um, we did kill a few wolves, so you didn't miss anything too crazy. Um, but yeah, good times. Life in, life in Pleasant Valley, though. Had a blizzard, of course, you know, that's going to happen. Okay, folks, everybody, we'll see you next time. Where am I on to next? We're going to probably just be hanging here. Um, probably the entire stream because we have to make a bear coat and that takes 60 hours. We're contending with uh, cabin fever. So I'm just going to probably just be hanging here for the entire session. <laughs> I would imagine it's going to, it's a lot of just back and forth and, you know, this and that. Um, and then, um, I don't know. I'm thinking... Once we leave here, I think probably going to the dam kind of makes sense because I just don't see any other time that we're going to need to go there. And we're here already, so we might as well just pop into the dam, loot that, and then come back here. And then we'll probably start Signal Void. Um, Kind of, I don't know, I'm not going to make a beeline for the Far Territories, but I'll probably start working my way that direction. We have to figure out. The, we have to solve the problem of having the map kind of divided in half like it is. There's a rope climb between this side of the map and and the other side of the map. And so that means that we can't just carry everything with us like we normally would. Um, we'll have to have like, like a base of tools and things on one side of the map and then a redundant set on the other side. So that means probably making another travoy for the other side of the map, that kind of thing. Um, yeah, I'll probably, I'll probably stream tomorrow, um, tomorrow around 11, something like that. I'll be around 11 Pacific. Okay, folks, that's it for Shabby. We'll see you next time. Take Shabby.